Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back. And today I'm going to show you guys how you can unlock Steam games early with a VPN. Now, if you're at the edge of your seat, unable to wait for your games on Steam to launch, I can understand how you feel and why you may want to just play it early on. Uh, instead of waiting till the next day, maybe you have a day off and you just want to play it the same day. Now, thankfully, it's not that hard to unlock games early on Steam. If you know the right tricks, then you can just get access to it no matter your location. Location. For PC gaming, Steam is the best choice, with more than 95 million users. Now, since users on this platform come from differing time zones, each region will have a different release time or even a different launch date, and it has been common to release games in a staggered manner, one region at a time. Now, all you need to do is get access to your games early on, is simply use a reliable VPN. So, what you're going to need to do first is, let's say we're trying to access, let's just go with Dying Light light right and so let's say dying light is you know releasing tomorrow or sometime after tomorrow or whenever it is so if you don't want to wait what you could do is simply just load the game so you can you already have purchased the game and you have it and everything so go ahead and start preloading it and then stop the preloading just quit steam and make sure that you quit steam completely so you don't want it to be active in the background and just go ahead and exit it completely and once you've done that you want to activate your vpn service now there are too many vpns out there and i understand it can be confusing so i've tested over a couple of dozen vpns and i've narrowed it down to these three as the best overall of course they all vary in budgets and features so you can pick and choose depending on your situation and preferences and your specific needs and budget of course uh, so you can pick one of these vpns they're all very reliable now most games do release at midnight um, and australia and new zealand are the first countries usually to hit midnight um, so you probably want to connect to those or you can connect to the game where it's been made so so if the game developer is in uh, italy or Germany you can try connecting to these as well um, so you can try your luck between the country of origin of the game or the Australian or New Zealand servers so in this case I'm just going to use ExpressVPN as an example and I'll go connect to let's just go with Australia and I'll connect to the server and once I'm connected all I have to do is just launch Steam again and this will make Steam think that I'm located in Australia allowing me to preload the game early and then I can just download any necessary additional files or game updates and just go ahead and press the play button so now steam thinks that i am in australia and that's pretty much how it works it really is that simple now why do you need a vpn for this well when you're accessing steam you direct it to the store that corresponds to your ip address so if you use a vpn connection to access games on steam the ip address that is detected will be the one that corresponds to your vpn servers in instead of the area in which you're really located. So when you use a VPN and you connect to an Australian server in this example, you'll be directed to the Australian store instead of your own local Steam store which could be Europe or the US, where the release date might be a little bit later or where midnight may come hours later, allowing you to start playing games on Steam much sooner. Once the game is unlocked in your region, you can disconnect from your VPN server and just use the Steam service as usual. Now, of course, a VPN is not just for unlocking games earlier. You can also use it to uh, potentially decrease your ping. If you're having ping issues, you can use it to access services that may not be available to you. It could be specific websites, Sites. It could be specific games that are not available to you. Maybe you can get access to country exclusive discounts. You can secure your device while you're torrenting and you can secure your device while you're on public Wi-Fi as well. So using a VPN definitely has a lot of utility besides unlocking games early. And again, if you're interested, you have these three VPNs. I mean, ExpressVPN is overall the best of the best. It's the most reliable, consistent and easiest to use. NordVPN is more of a well-rounded option that offers Offers a whole bunch of bonus features for a very reasonable price and Surfshark is going to be the best budget VPN that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost without sacrificing much 
on security performance or features for that matter. So if you guys are interested in any of these, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about the privacy policy, speed streaming and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. And of course, they're all covered by a 30 day money back guarantee. So you can test drive these VPNs for 30 days. Otherwise, you can just get yourself the refund if you're not satisfied for whatever reason. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.